Hello and welcome to Swamika Stock In and Out Template. This tool mainly shows you your financials over your products and their categories and also your overall inventory report after all the purchases and sales you make. It is constructed by five parts. These are the dashboard, the item list, the received products, sales and settings. So let's start with the settings. Input the product descriptions, categories and unit types into this section. You will use these options in the other sheets by selecting them from a drop down menu. So let's give an example. Let's say we have this new television and the category is going to be TVs and the units is going to be pieces so we don't have to re-enter them. Now we can go to the item list. Input the product information for each row. Their code, category, description, unit type, how many you have at the moment, alert level and remarks. The alert level is the minimum level of quantity you agree to have for that product and once the final stocks get below this level, it will be indicated on the dashboard by colored with red. You may input your notes about the product on the remarks column. So, let's enter our example. Now we can go to the received products. Input the product information for purchase date, codes, received quantity and purchase price. Once you choose the code from the drop down menu, the information for category, products and units will be updated automatically. Now we can go to sales. Input the product information for sales date, codes, sold quantity and sales price. Like in the last sheet, category, products and unit types will appear once you choose the code from the drop down menu. Now we may check the overall situation from the dashboard. In this section, you don't need to input any data. After you input your data in each section, all you have to do is refresh the table. Once you hit a refresh charts button, the charts and the pivot table below will be renewed. It is crucial that you press on the refresh charts button once there is a change in the data. The charts on the top indicate the financials of categories and products. The slices on the top of the charts affect both of the charts except the product slicer. That only affects the chart on the right. Select the necessary data to see your overall situation. To select multiple options you may either press the control button on your keyboard and select the options or you may click on this small button and select the options just like this. The chart will give you the basic financials for each category and product that you would like to display. By clicking minus and plus buttons on the second chart, you may hide or show the products. On the pivot table below, you may check the overall inventory, costs, revenue and profit for each product. The inventory quantity will be colored in red if you set the alert level in the item list section. The cost of sold quantity indicates the cost of goods which have been sold. The cost of inventory indicates the cost of goods which haven't been sold. Thanks for watching and don't forget to check our other templates at www.someka.net.